how can you bring more balance into your life uh, with with work and, and family or work and rest? I know a lot of times if you're in the mainstream or if you're, you're a minimum wage worker or if you're middle management, you're not going to get rest, really. I mean, and a lot of times if you're not working 40 to 50 hours a week or if you express a need, then you can get fired <laughs> or, or whatever. But anyways, you, you have a strong theme of balance either coming to you or it's what you need to be focusing on. The reality is, is that you can have your own business and you don't have to work 50 hours a week. You don't have to work 40 hours a week. If you do what you do, then you're going to make money doing what you do and how you live. So this is what we want to do for everyone and support everyone with. So, so this means in business, you're going to be working with this sort of manipulative energy. And that's what happens, Bruce, when you don't do business from the heart. You're not authentic about your wants and needs. Sometimes you're protecting the bottom line and you're lying to people. Or if you're in sales, sometimes you're lying to people. And we want to help straighten that energy out. So they can, you can use that wonderful creative energy that you have for all good. And when you're using it for good, you have a different vibe, a higher vibe. Yeah, cause and you're more attractive. Because it feels good for you. And your angel card guidance is to believe in yourself. So like I was saying before, absolutely no doubt with what you need to do or what you need to say. And honestly, if you are in some kind of intellectual conflict with somebody or there's some manipulation going on, be yourself. Believe in yourself so you can... Be authentic, and then you'll draw in more people who make you feel good.